Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Judea! Why are you here? Why are you here? Perhaps you have now awakened and will rouse the dawn. The bias of the media is merely a small representation of the years of institutional bigotry against your people. So why have you now been moved to action? Why have you now been stirred? And will your righteous indignation end tonight? Or will you instead decide to dig deep within the depths of your soul and honor your legacy and walk with pride? Today you are here because you know who you are. That is why you are here. You know who you are. You are the sons and daughters of former slaves in Egypt. Of warrior poets and kings who slayed giants and queens filled with courage and prophets and dreamers and dispensers of justice, the great architect himself. When he created you, looked down upon you and had to announce out loud that it was good. So that is why you are here today. You are here to honor your legacy. You taught the world the law. You taught the world wisdom. You taught the world to pursue justice. You taught the world the inherent value of mankind. And you taught the world to be free. And the way you affirm that you are free is by ensuring that to any one or entity who calls into question your right to exist, they have another thing coming. So that is why you are here today. That is why you stand today with Israel. But will your fervor dissipate after today? Or will it continue? Will we not all be fire and speak out not only against the media bias, but against every form of bigotry against your people, whether it be in the college classroom or in the newspaper? Ladies and gentlemen, there are people in Europe who are calling for your deaths again. So will your embers burn out, or will you not elect to perpetually light up the sky? There are people harassing your children on the college campus. So will you be silent? Or will you speak truth to power and rise to the occasion? You have not come this far out of the literal ashes to have your people be defamed. You have not come this far out of the pogroms of Russia to have your people be harassed. You have not come this far out of the inquisitions of Spain and out of the expulsions of your land to have your people be persecuted. They are calling for your persecution and your harassment. Do you know what is the proper response? Rise, Zion. Rise. They are calling. They are
teaching bigotry in the classrooms, in the papers, in the media. They have called for your deaths, not only in Europe, but also in certain places here in America. Do you understand what your obligation is? Yeah. Honor your legacy. Rise, Zion. Rise. Yeah.